Situated far in the North Atlantic, midway between the continents of Europe and America, is Iceland. It's a land of truly dramatic contrasts that more than lives up to its title, Land of Ice and Fire. The east of Iceland, geologically the oldest part of the country, is a veritable treasure chest of natural gems. Stretching from the town of Bakafjörður in the north to Skaftafjörður National Park in the south, it's an area of ever-changing landscapes and sights guaranteed to delight, inspire and challenge the traveller. The east is also special in that it's the only area in Iceland where reindeer herds roam wild. Rated by many to be Iceland's most beautiful area, Skaftavet National Park is a glorious combination of vastly diverse landscapes. There's the majestic glacier of Atnajökull, Europe's largest ice cap, towering mountain peaks, lush birch woodlands, and a sprawling coastline of sandy glacial deposits. The park's fine center has excellent facilities for tourists. Close by is the famous Glacier Lagoon. It's an unforgettable experience to take in the sight of large icebergs floating about in its deep blue waters, and even perhaps spot some seals that have come in search of food. East of Vatnajökull Glacier is another exciting natural gem for the hiker, namely the nature reserve of the remote Lones Arrivi area. The mountain lodge is the best starting point for a range of mapped hiking routes in the area. Cut deep into a barren, rugged highland landscape is the canyon Havrakvamadluvr. Extending to a depth of up to 160 meters, it's an awesome sight to behold the powerful glacial river Jökulsau run through this canyon. Moving westwards, we come to the remote valley of Löjgarvatladalur. Steam rises from the hot pools that give the valley its name. Here in this magnificent surrounding, the weary traveller can bathe and relax in the natural hot pools or even take a leisurely hot shower, compliments of Mother Nature herself. There are many waterfalls in the eastern region, however the waterfall Hengifoss makes for an especially dramatic and beautiful sight. Visiting the Lagerfljot River, one has an opportunity to possibly catch sight of the mysterious monster the locals are convinced inhabits its murky depths. Moving eastwards to the coast, we come to another classic feature of the eastern landscape, the fjords. Chiseled by glaciers, the rugged fjord coastline is comprised of dramatic sheer cliffs that drop vertically to the sea. The area is especially rich in bird life, and many migrant birds first reach land here after the long trek across the Atlantic. The rich offshore fishing grounds sustain a number of thriving fishing villages, where one can take time out to enjoy some local hospitality. However, a number of fjords are today deserted. This is an area steeped in folklore and peopled with trolls, elves and ghosts. The extreme northeast has some of the country's best mapped hiking routes. Some, under the watchful gaze of giant trolls long since turned to stone. One of Iceland's most unusual mountains, Kvitserkur, is to be found here, as well as a number of other highly interesting geological features. Iceland's eastern region is an area of vast natural contrasts that are sure to leave a lasting impression on the visitor. The east offers the best in tourist services, and access to the region is also excellent, either by road, air, or scheduled ferry from Europe. So, if you plan on visiting Iceland and want to experience the unique beauty of Icelandic nature in all its diversity, you simply have to come to the east. For more detailed information, please visit our website www.east.is.